Welcome to another episode of Go Big, the one show that focuses on all that North Dallas has to offer. I'm Denise Milliken, and I'm a local realtor here in North Dallas. And welcome to another episode of Go Big. If you have any questions at any time of the area or have a desire to buy or sell and need some assistance, please don't hesitate to reach out and ask. My number is listed at the end of this episode. The State Fair of Texas is the longest running fair in the U.S. It originally opened back in 1886 at this very site on 88 acres back then. Now it's a staggering 277 acres of space. The State Fair is not only the longest running State Fair, but it's one of the biggest. Here are some fun facts. The fair was shut down during World War I in 1918, as this very area was converted into a temporary army encampment. The fair employs 6,000 seasonal workers each year and has up to 3 million people that come for a visit. Upon entering the fair, Big Tex is always there for a howdy welcome. He made his debut in 1952, but didn't have a voice till 1953. The big guy suffered an electrical fire the last day of the fair in 2012, but came back snazzier than ever in 2013, three feet taller. Howdy, Tex. Everything's bigger in Texas. Another fun fact. Did you know before Big Tex came to the fair, he used to stand in a nearby small Texas town as a 49-foot Santa Claus? That just makes me want to crush on him even more. Don't forget to take a ride on the Texas Star Ferris Wheel. It was built in 1985, and it's the largest Ferris wheel in the country at 20 stories tall. It was built in Italy and features 16,000 lights. Another must-do when you're at the fair is the Texas OU game that's been playing here since 1929. The Longhorns face off the Sooners right here at the Cotton Bowl. They have famous acts that play year after year. Famous folks such as Elvis Presley, the Beatles, played right here on this stage. Not too shabby, huh? So my all-time favorite part of the fair is the food. In particular, the fried food. If it can somehow fit on a stick and be dipped in hot boiling batter, it has been done at the State Fair. Here are some of the most famous fair foods of all time. Fletcher's Corny Dog made its debut in 1942 at the State Fair of Texas. Fried Oreos, fried bacon, put a fork in me already, I am done. One last fun fact, any coupons you don't use on the day of your visit never expire. I help people every day move and relocate to the North Dallas area and would love to help you too. If you have any questions at any time of the area or have a desire to buy or sell and need some assistance, please don't hesitate to reach out and ask. My number is listed at the end of this episode. If you like this video and want to receive more videos that are focused on all that North Dallas area has to offer, make sure you subscribe. Thanks again for watching and remember to always go big!